Hello, my name is David Brody, and I'm the author of Morning and Celebration. Fortunately, enlightened governments and societies are gradually doing away with a ban on gay marriages. In Orthodox Jewish circles, only recently has there been a move to recognize the existence of gay Jews, as well as the rights of women to participate more actively as teachers and the equivalents of rabbis. The new title of Rabbah, being bestowed on women who qualify in a rabbinical training program, is an excellent harbinger of what may become the validation of gay orthodox marriages. The Rabbahs will be a separate but hopefully equal category of rabbis, perhaps specializing in matters relating to their own sex. Similarly, religiously sanctioned gay marriages could use a different formula than that practiced for heterosexual marriages. I know of a marriage service specially designed for a Kohen, a ritual priest, marrying a divorced woman, a category which is forbidden to Kohanim. A separate marriage service specially designed for gay men and lesbians could easily perform the same purpose. So, watch this space, hopefully within my lifetime.